Hey, Donald Bell here at CES 2015 with my favorite moment of the entire show, the time I get to interview Gary Stern from Stern Pinball. Gary is back here again with the new machine. Gary, I'm going to have to interrupt you. I'm sorry. I know you're doing so great. But let's talk about WrestleMania. Tell me about your new machine, Gary. Well, it's WrestleMania, of course. It's, uh, you know, it's a great theme for pinball, and this game is, has a unique, special new feature in it, and that is it's got an upper play field, a wrestling ring. With the upper play field, there are kickers within the ropes, so you get to keep the game. You use the flipper buttons like that, and you keep, keep the ball in action up there. And once you finally get the ball into the eject hole, it's pinning the other wrestler. Now, there's some other advancements here as far as the technology is concerned. What's different technologically about this new series of pinball machines compared to the previous generations? Um, this game is the first uh, pinball machine that we uh, are making with our new Spike electronic system. Uh, before that, uh, up until now, we've used for the last decade or so what we call the SAM system. And if I can show you inside here, um, we, have, um, a, we have a very small uh, board a, a sound a sound CPU board, and instead of having a big CPU board and a, a big I/O board and a big fluorescent tube, you can see they're very bright LEDs here. Uh, we have just this one small board, and then we have data cables that go down to node boards or semi-smart boards uh, within the game. It's a scalable system, so when we want to do more, we just put in more node boards. And I've opened up a few of these cabinets before and it is usually a mess of wires. This is a lot cleaner. Uh, I can see you're using like Ethernet cables that can be readily replaced. Uh, it looks a lot more like a little computer inside here. It, it is a lot cleaner and under the hood it's a lot cleaner. Um, the uh, SAM system games have about a half a mile of wire in them and this has significantly less wiring and significantly neater wiring. It's much easier to, uh, to build. It's much easier to, uh, to troubleshoot should there be a problem. Now, is it going to be at all possible to open this up to see under the hood or, or can we get someone to, to help us do that? Or we, we can do that if the key's here. It will take me just a minute. Well, just a minute here, but it's impressive. If anyone has not seen the inside of a pinball machine, this will be a real treat. Uh, you think the inside of a computer looks neat. This is a... Uh, this is, this is a, a wire fetishist dream. <laughs> All right, we'll see if, uh, if we can get the new WrestleMania cabinet open. Take the glass off. The glass, aside from protecting you from getting a, a pinball up on your face, is uh, also dampens the sound of these machines a lot, too. You will also probably hear a bunch of balls falling out of it because we haven't set taking the balls out yet, but I'm just going to let them drop out. As I said, you would hear a bunch of balls falling out of it. So yeah, the, the wiring in here, even though it looks like a lot of wires, guys, this is significantly less than you'd typically see uh, on a modern pinball machine. And you see a lot of these cleaner components that are all attached with uh, Ethernet cabling. We actually have in some uh, The Walking Dead with this system, even though it was made with the SAM board system in it. If you come down to our booth, you'll see a, a demonstration unit of The Walking Dead all opened up uh, with uh, the SAM system and all opened up with the Spike system. All right. Well, Gary, thank you so much for giving us a tour of your new machine, WrestleMania. I'm very excited to, to play this. Hopefully, you'll stick around for a few minutes.